In spite of the fear, the pain, and the safety problems, we're still mostly stuck with needles for getting injections. Chemical engineer Samir Mitra Gotri says there's a good reason why current needle-free injectors are not widely used. The biggest problem is that the jet goes deep into the skin where it hits the blood vessels and nerves and that causes bleeding and pain. Now engineers at the University of California Santa Barbara and Stratagent Life Sciences are testing a needle-free device that even looks less frightening. It breaks a drug dose up into tiny micro jets that barely penetrate the skin. It has two parts, a durable component that has the battery and the brains and a disposable uh, component that has the reservoir as well as the microjet nozzle. The patient puts these two parts together, removes the adhesive and places it on the body for, uh, to start the therapy. They wrote in Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences that animal tests with insulin showed it works. And we make sure that our device can deliver sufficient quantities of insulin into the body for therapeutic applications. While the device still needs to be tested in people, the researchers say they're confident that you won't even feel a little prick. I'm Brad Closa.